Praise the Lord, dear friends. God has given us a new day for each of us. As we have gathered here to adore the Eucharistic Lord, let us surrender all of our needs before Him. Because the Word of God says in Matthew chapter 7, verse 7, Ask and you shall receive. Seek and you shall find. Knock and the door shall be opened to you. This morning, God hears our voice when we call out to Him. Then let us, surrendering all of our needs, all of our problems, all of our irritations, whatever that we have, surrender to the Lord. And indeed, Jesus, who is present in the sacrament, will bless us abundantly and will fill us with His graces and with His blessings. Among us today, we have Father Sebastian. He will, he will take ahead with the adoration and will speak more on today's Eucharistic miracle. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Do youngsters welcome to this Eucharistic adoration. Feel the presence of God in your life. As we begin to reflect upon the Eucharistic miracle, I invite all of you to pause for a while and invite the Holy Spirit among you. Fill your hearts and minds to receive the Holy Eucharist amidst of us. This day is going to be a blessed day for each one of us. As we are going to hear the word of God this morning, let this word may help you, guide you, protect you from all the dangers. Come, my dear young friends. Kneel down and welcome the Eucharistic Lord and Mistress. Jeremiah chapter 33 verse 3 Call to me and I will answer you and will tell you the great and hidden things that you have not known. Call to me, says the Lord, and God will surely answer us. This morning as we are adoring Him, as we are kneeling down before Him, He will answer all of our needs. Let us call out to Him this morning because our God listens to our prayers. Our God listens to our cry. Let us come before Him, adore Him, and let us sing, Father God. Father God, I wonder how I managed to exist without the knowledge of your parenthood and your loving care. But now, but now I am your child, I'm adopted in your family, and I can never be alone. Father God, you're there beside me I will sing your praises I will sing your praises I will sing your praises Forevermore Forevermore I will sing your praises, Lord Jesus, this morning I will praise your name, Lord Jesus Because, Lord Jesus, you are truly present In this Eucharist in this blessed sacrament, you are present, O Lord. I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises forevermore. Psalm chapter 23, verse 1. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Verse 2. He, he, he makes me lie down in green pastures. He leads me beside still waters. Psalm chapter 23 verse 6 Surely goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life and I shall dwell in the house of the Lord my whole life long. As we have come here before the Eucharistic Lord we are in His presence. In His presence always Jesus takes care of us. Always Jesus loves us. Always Jesus wants us to be like Him. Then this morning, let us increase our faith in the Lord Jesus. Let us surrender our lives, our careers, our jobs, our studies to the Lord. And let us sing to Him once again, raising both of our hands. And let us say, I will worship you, Father. I will worship you, Father. I will 
sing your praise forevermore. Forevermore, I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises. Forevermore, I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises. I will sing your praises. Forevermore, Psalm chapter twenty-five, verse five. Lead me in your truth and teach me, for you are the God of my salvation. For you I wait all day long. Lord Jesus, teach me your truth. Show me the truth, the Lord. Lord Jesus, you have said, I am the way, I am the truth, I am the life. Lord Jesus, this day, as we are blinded by so many things, Lord Jesus, you clearly show us that truth. Lord Jesus, we are confused in our lives. We do not know where to go. We do not know what stream to choose. We do not know what career path to choose. Oh Lord, help us this morning. Lord Jesus, we are weak in our studies. Lord Jesus, strengthen us. Fill us with your Holy Spirit. Fill us with your wisdom. Lord Jesus, as we raise our hands before you, we surrender our academic year into your hands. We surrender our exams, our assignments, our presentations. Oh Lord Jesus, we surrender all of our things that we have before you, Lord. Lord Jesus, take Take care of our lives, O Lord. Bless us, O Lord. Take care of us, O Lord. Deliver us from all evil, O Lord Jesus. O Lord, have mercy on me, O Lord. Lord Jesus, be with us. Guard us, guide us, O Lord. I will sing your praises, O Lord. I will worship you, Lord. I will thank you, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus, because you have been so kind to me, you have given me another opportunity to spend some. With you, sing oh Lord, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. I worship you, Lord. I will sing your praises forevermore. Hallelujah! 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 hallelujah. Psalm chapter 27, verse 7. Hear, O Lord, when I cry aloud, be gracious to me and answer me. Come, my heart says, seek his face. Your face, O Lord, do I seek. Lord Jesus, this morning we seek your face. Lord Jesus, have mercy on us. Let your face shine on us this morning. O Lord Jesus, you lead us, guard us, guide us. Hallelujah. So Lord, Lord have mercy, Lord we praise you, Jesus we thank you, Jesus we praise you, we worship you, Abba Father we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, Holy Spirit we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Dear friends, today we reflect upon the topic Eucharist gives us peace. We have a Eucharistic miracle for us today is Textla, Mexico. The miracle from Textla, Mexico. On October 21st, 2006, The effusion of reddish substance was noted while the communion was distributed. The priest invited a nun to help him out to distribute the communion and when they were distributing, they saw a blessed hose having a reddish substance. So that was sent to a, a theological studies and examination. The committee was formed, informed the bishop. And then Bishop Religio Savella organized the theologians to come forward to study this matter. The similar incidences were happening in Mexico that in Paris St. Mary on October 12th. And then the 
the entire incidences were gathered together and studied and then on october 12th 2013 they declared it as a miracle and even today that is exposed for the veneration my dear friends eucharist is a real presence of jesus for all of us we need to believe and that is our faith that jesus is truly present in the blessed eucharist eucharist lord is a source of our life morning we have started our day being in his presence this eucharistic gives us peace as we go out into this world the work that we are going to do the studies that you are going to undertake the friends that whom you are going to meet should be helped by your presence how god is giving us at this moment peace of mind you carry this peace within you and express and share with the people whom you meet show in the work that you do perform the studies that you undertake as we reflect on this eucharistic miracle we continue to experience the eucharistic lord in our midst in our lives and never to hesitate never to ignore never to avoid of receiving every day the eucharistic lord because that is our strength that is our spiritual food that is what is going to nourish our body our soul therefore my dear friends kneel down for the final blessing and receive his blessings and go forth and face the world with full of courage may god continue to bless each one of us let us pray Lord our loving father praise and thank you for the gift of life that you have given to us gift of eucharistic for us gift of your flesh as a spiritual food as isaiah chapter 26 verses 3 says stay first mind in peace those who trust in god we trust in you we lift up our youth those who are going for a job those who are undertaking studies those who are looking for the partners those who are in difficulties we lift all of them help them lord give them the peace of mind that they may be able to face the world challenge the challenges that are coming on their way we make this prayer through christ our lord amen sacrament most holy sacrament
praise you lord jesus praise you lord jesus thank you lord jesus thank you lord jesus love you lord jesus love you lord jesus adore you lord jesus adore you lord jesus hallelujah 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 time for homework we have psalm chapter 25 verses 4 to 7 is the homework for us so whenever you get a free time whenever you feel like to read the scripture take out this day take out this passage for the day and reflect read and meditate surely it is going to be a great help and assistance for us we wish you all the best on behalf of our kongoni charismatic group and we wish you all the best and success have a blessed day ahead praise the lord dear friends today we finished with the fifth day of the eucharistic miracle the pdf of the eucharistic miracle is given in the description box below kindly share this pdf of the eucharistic miracle with your friends do share the link of today's video to your friends and your family members have a blessed day